everyone, this is Annalyn Arapal from BIT3A that I'm going to have my reaction video about the lesson 1 and lesson 2 that has been discussed by Mr. Marnell. So the first topic is all about the differences of microprocessor and microcontroller. So microprocessor and its uses. It is a program semiconductor device which decodes and ex executes instructions. And its uses is to accept binary data, input processes that data and then provides output base on the instruction stored in the memory. What is microcontroller and how it works? It is a self-contained system with a processor, memory, and peripherals and can be used as an embedded system. They run one specific program and are dedicated to single tasks. So here are the differences between microprocessor and microcontroller. Microprocessor is the heart of system. You can use it in an impact of system. Cost of enter system is high. Most of the microprocessor do not have power saving features. It is mainly used in personal computers, while microcontroller has a processor along with internal components. You can use it in a compact system. Cost of the entire system is low. Most of the microcontroller often power saving mood. It is mainly used in washing machines and embedded systems. Clap. We all know that technology is powerful. Technology is a tool that can improve education in many ways. Teachers, students, and parents are all benefited from free online resources, personalized learning materials, and opportunities for advanced learning. Technology is indispensable in our work. Technology is the application of science to address the problems of our daily life. The fast phase of technological advancements means the adv advancements are continuous, but not everybody has equal access. The role of technology in today's world and in the future. Technology is an essential part of our lives today and few can imagine living without. By the help of technology, we achieve a lot. The technology we create now creates the future, and it should be for the people and make things easier and not complicated. Technology shapes the future and it can help to make it compatible with the nature. Shall we have breakfast together? Evolution of microprocessor. Transistor was invented in 1948, December 23, 1947, and well loved. IC was invented in 1958, Fairchild Semiconductors by Texas Instrument J. Kilby. The first microprocessor was invented by Intel or Integrated Electronics. Microprocessor application. A microprocessor application makes daily life easier because of its low, low power, small weight, and vast application in every field. So we have the advantages and the disadvantages of microprocessors. So let's have first the advantages. The first is high processing speed, compact size, easy maintenance, can perform complex mathematics, and flexible, can be improved accordingly to requirements. And let's have the disadvantages. First is overheating, of course, due to overuse. Performance depends on size and data. Large board size than microcontrollers. Most microprocessors do not support floating point operations. In microprocessors, there are five generations. So the first generation is from 1971 to 1972, the era of the first generation 
came which brought microprocessor like Intel 4004, Rockwell International, PPS for Intel 808 and others. The second generation. The second generation marked the development of 8-bit microprocessors from 1973 to 1978. Processor like Intel 8085, Motorola 6800, and 6801, and others come into existence. The third generation. Third generation brought forward the 16-bit processors like Intel 8086, 80186, 80286, Motorola 6800, 68010, and others. From 1979 to 1980, this generation used the HMOS technology. The fourth generation. The fourth generation came into existence from 19... 81 to 1995. The 32-bit processor using HMOS fabrication came into existence. Intel 80386 and Motorola 68020 are some of the popular processor of this generation. The last generation is the fifth generation. From 1995 till now, we are in the 5th generation on 68-bit processor like Pentom, Celeron, Dowal, Quad, and Octa-Core processor came into existence.